Hey, it's Natasha. And Khalil. And we are the co-hosts of Woke, Woke and Free. Free. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in to our 139th episode of Woke and Free. If you've been tuning in every week for Woke and Free Wednesday, you know that Woke and Free is all about being real, honest, and real. <laughs> like super real, guys. That last, the last, last week episode was nuts. And we don't even just keep it real and honest with each other, but it's also with you. So what do we talk about? We talk about everything and anything important to us, to you, the world, and nothing is off the table. This week's really exciting. It's another special Woken Free story time. We're calling this Ranting Truth. But, 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 before we go down that, <laughs> I'm not even going to describe what that is. <gasps> it's your favorite time of the day. Tasha's monologue. So are you is ready, it, Kalil? Is it that time? Are you sure? It's it's that time again, man. Oh, joy. Yes. Hold on to the horsies, guys. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> So excited. Shout out to Kevin Hart. <laughs> if you've seen his latest, uh, what is that? His, was it? A, is it the latest? I mean, or no, it before be he did that, before, yeah, the, before the Netflix thing, he did a show like, and that's where he did the so excited. Yeah. Thing. That was amazing. I can't even. Uh, Bert, if you have gone to WokenFree.com and you have downloaded the Podbean app so that you could not only download and listen to this episode, but you can comment and really join the conversation we applaud you thank you thank you thank you for your support thank you for taking the time to join a woke and free conversation a conversation you will not get anywhere else on the planet so you rock next if you're like tosh i love you i you're my sis but i can't get another app on my phone that's all right boo that's okay what you can do is make sure you're subscribed and following the show on whatever platform you're choosing so you're like, well, where do I go for that? So go to WokenFree.com, click on the Listen tab, and you'll see all the different platforms that you can catch a show on. So for instance, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Google Play, YouTube, SoundCloud, iHeartRadio, Spotify. I'm literally losing oxygen. There's so many places you can catch a show, guys. So make sure you go and do that. When it comes to sharing, it is caring, except for COVID-19, always. Come on, social distancing, social distancing, guys. And what you can do while you social distance is you can listen to podcast episodes. So you Easy. can, exactly. You can six feet apart, listen to this, share this, tweet this out, get the word out to your friends, to your family, to your coworkers, the world. And uh, we not only will love and appreciate you, but you just allow the world to kind of dive in and have more people joining this conversation. So again, you rock. Now, when it comes to social media, since I mentioned it, find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and Pinterest at Woken Free. And now, if you have 90 seconds, which, okay, you should have much more time than that now with COVID-19, what can you do? You can review the show. So we not only would appreciate reviews on, for instance, say iTunes, five stars, five stars, guys, five stars. Uh, but you can review the show on any platform you're choosing to listen to this on, right? So make sure, again, go to WokenFree.com, click on the Listen tab, and then pick your platform that you want to listen to this on, and then definitely listen to the episode and review the show before you leave. Alrighty, scene end. That's it, guys. All right. Now I guess we're ready for this next episode. This the ranting <laughs> truth, yes. The topic that it's going to be very fun because people love their story times. Don't and, get too excited over there in your chair over there. But just to make sure before we start, is this a story that they should be listening to at bedtime? Or is it a story they should listen to before they start their day? Ooh, I love that question. I would say before they start the day, but what do you say? I would say they can listen to it right after lunch to get them pumped up. Mmm. Nice. Just in case the tryptophan is setting in. <laughs> Before the itis sets in, you mean? <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> Which is caused by that chemical, yes. True that. Well, if you're eating bad stuff, some of us don't have the luxury for eating things that have the, that chemical get released. So. Oh, all right. Yeah, That's green a living. Good point. That's a good point. Mm -hmm. People are dying in the streets. Can we do better? Do people really value human life? No. Does money mean more than lives? Yes. Even monopoly money? We shall see. Can people ever change? We shall see. What's it going to take? Morality trumps all. Live with purpose. Act with belief. 
Stop with the excuses. Will it be easier? Never. Will most do it? We shall see. Should people pray? Why not? Do people like to struggle? Boy, bye. How long will it take to change? Can we say eternity? Is there any hope? Yes! What can someone do today? Live woke and free forever! Hey there. Do you have a book that you want to share with the Woke and Free Nation? Are you a business owner looking to share your product or service with the podcasting world? Well, guess what? You can book an ad with us on our Contact Us page at WokenFree.com. We're super excited to speak with you about curating a unique ad that will get your message across the Woken Free platform. So go to the Contact Us page at WokenFree.com. That is W-O-K-E-N-F-R-E-E.com. Because Woken Free is more than a podcast. It's a way of life and offers an innovative way to promote your platform in the exploding podcasting space. Amazing. Literally like goosebumps everywhere. Yeah, I mean, I was feeling that throughout my whole universe. I mean, I might just have to, like, we might just have to, even ourselves, just, like, listen to this over and over again. I think I'm going to the moon. It was too I mean, I think I'm already there. Oh, right. (laughs) (laughs) That's good. You're on the moon. Or maybe I went back to my my home planet, right? Oh, yeah. Zircon. Zertok. <laughs> with my Katias or whatever. <laughs> no, 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 or was no, it, it wasn't. No, you don't remember what, what was it was. Katorn. Katorn. Katorns. Was that on a story time yet or no? Yes, we did this already. Really? The Katorns? I believe so, yes. Wow, I don't remember that. I know, it's really? been a long time. Wow, we've had that many story times. Yeah, this is, yeah, we're like, we're, that we're now, going. Guys. I can't even remember the ones we did. It's, nice, that's good. Out of control. There's a lot of content there. It's a lot of content. We're literally giving it to them every single Wednesday. you get a lot of different stuff. It's amazing. There's there's so much value in this podcast. Like, I can't even believe it. I can't even. (laughs) (laughs) You're ridiculous, Khalil. (laughs) Complete fool. That's why people say, you know, y'all have sound like you're having a lot of fun over there. How come? (laughs) You call this fun? I call this life. I'm just taking oh. life as it is. Well, like I say, life gets funnier by the minute. I so. tell you that. I'm telling you, life does stranger things than fiction. That's the interesting thing. I mean, there's stranger things and then there's also life. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's stranger? Well, we shall that's see. different. Stra- I mean, now you're talking about, I don't know if you're talking about stranger things. Exactly, yes. Know. Oh, okay. Yeah, Absolutely. you talk about that. All mm-hmm. right. So I see. Yeah. So then what, what was the inspiration for this new story time? The inspiration was the idea that Things are out of control. And, and as much as we as people and we as in our society, and I'm talking about the global race here, as much as we would like to have control, I think having something, this pandemic ha- happening really like <laughs> puts us to a hole to say, you know what? You guys are not in control. And that's just kind of where we're at. And it's always been that way. We have a false pretense of control in our lives, in our society. And there's law and order. But these are all contrived concepts derived and initiated within our minds. So they don't actually really exist, like money, like time. These are concepts within our mind. They don't actually have actual value in the universe. <laughs> but we we don't have to give up. And we don't have to lose our minds. But we have to keep it 100, keep it woken free. And understand that beyond living in a life without control, that there are things that we can control within ourselves and how we act and how we do and the decisions we make. And so we need to get invigorated and very, very impassionate, passionate about the fact that things have got to change, especially in America, because we're the leaders amongst all the other nations. So let's get it popping. And things are bound to change, though. <laughs> yes. That's what's interesting. <laughs> Nothing's constant. Things change. Mm, mm, mm. Who are you so doing? that's what we got to remember, too. Exactly. We get stuck and we don't see that there's any change possible. We think this is the way it's always been. It's going to always be this way. Correct. And we can't. And sometimes we lose track of what time really is. You mm. know, you'll be in shelter in place for two months, but you think it's been five years. Like. <laughs> You need to get your time right. Get your You're on time planet right. Earth, and planet Earth, we calculate time a certain way. But Try to follow that calculation. Don't it, just make up your own time in your mind. Is it planet Earth or is it planet dirt? That's a good question. 
Exactly. Or, you know, yeah, it could be, but what do aliens call our planet? K9735608390. Monkey City123. <laughs> I mean, I hope not, because they're not, I mean, they can call it like Ape City or something. Oh, snap. But not Monkey City. Baby Ape. Baby Ape. Baby Ape. <laughs> <laughs> that's where we're at. They said these are baby apes over there. Yeah. I we mean, don't know about these that's... ones. These are different birds here. <laughs> yeah, it's a, they, they would look say, at us and say, these are different birds. These are, I don't understand. These are different birds. <laughs> <laughs> well yeah it's hard to imagine what they would think watching i mean this. complete buffoons they would say we're complete fools the evolution <laughs> and the de-evolution yeah they would they say watch. we are they we this must be evolution. the de-evolved apes <laughs> it's hard to say now i mean yeah it's, it gets complicated you know apes What's can have difference? more compassion than us which is like <laughs> <laughs> really unreal. i mean you see how sense of coco was she was signing holding baby sweet baby she was a sweet bam bam she was a sweet girl yeah, but then that, that begs the question can an alligator be sweet and cuddly i mean i i just sent you a video about yeah, one who came up with a camera and he sounds. was just like hello yeah, I said, you know what a sweet bam bam. Sweet bam bam. Because they're the, they're the like one of the oldest species on the planet. Look so at turtles. Look how gracious that. and wonderful turtles are. Look how we mess with them and try to cut their heads off. They're crazy. Poor things. Sweet bam bam. No, you can't mess with the turtles. I know they're the nice. turtles are wonderful. Well, as we know, a, a person we both know will say, "We've got to save the turtles." <laughs> it's all about the turtles, and she knows you can. who she is, so oh, she yeah, should definitely. laugh immediately. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, it's so understandable. We have footage. There's we have to, <laughs> we have to save the turtles. That's good. <laughs> it's good to be an animal conservative. Or... Yes, an animal rights activist. Absolutely, we've got to save the turtles. We've got to save. It's really actually the one one of the few blessings happening out of this crisis what? is the 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 reduction of the environmental degradation that was happening when we all were going in our cars and pumping out our gas. So you think the air. honeybees will come back? Uh, yeah, they, they, they I come mean, back apparently from the, the rats dimension. are running New York City again. So they run these streets. They run these streets. <laughs> yeah, we do that. <laughs> so they're doing their business. Uh, the birds around here run these things. I tell you, oh, I yeah, think definitely. they're from the Bronx. They're gangster. I've never seen something like this in these streets. <laughs> they throwing up signs at us with Gang, their wings. Straight up gang signs. I don't they know if it's bloods, uh, crips, or whatever. I mean, but it's some avian gang gang sign, and it, they run these streets here. Yeah, they're very interesting birds. Different what, birds here. We'll, that's how we'll, we'll end it with that. There's exactly. Some different birds on these streets. There's, yes, and that statement can be really put across the world. <laughs> yes. There are different birds everywhere, but... When it comes to us and us being Woken Free Birds, listen, it's at that time again. We hope you enjoyed this Woken Free story time. We had a lot of fun making it. <laughs> it was, uh, it was special. It was Every one of them times. are special. They're just, they're special. And you yeah. say, you know, these are different birds here. They each have special parts in your heart. Oh, absolutely. Literally unforgettable. Filling different parts that you didn't even know were missing. You know, it's like, we're like, we're like Hallmark. Like, this is amazing. <laughs> uh, I think that goes beyond Hallmark. Hallmark isn't oh, filling Hallmark, the void. Hallmark channel. <laughs> what is Hallmark filling, filling your heart with? We're filling up all the voids in your heart. No one else True. is doing that. Who's True. doing that? You tell me who's doing it, and then I'll write it down. I like this passion. Go ahead. Yeah. Mm. I'll write it down on a piece of paper. Mm. Yeah, that's exactly what I would do with it. Different tell birds me. again. Different birds. <laughs> that's what I would have know. Where does all this passion come from? Baby, baby. I don't know. Baby, baby. <laughs> okay, man. If, if that's your answer, that was very, you know, you added a lot with that point there. I very I appreciate your input. You hold your, your <laughs> condescending comments to yourself. No, I definitely appreciate your input, and I'll take it to heart, as I took the rant to heart. I'm so glad. Thank you. <laughs> and see, guys. This is how newscasters men, speak to each other, And men though. expect for women no. to welcome them in the bedroom at night. No, That's you, what I think is funny. Yeah, but you're saying that. But these are how newscasters. They speak to each other when they love each they other. They say, maybe, 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 maybe. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> definitely. That's been Wouldn't said that before. Wouldn't that be amazing if, you, if we heard them and they were like, baby, 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 baby. I think, <laughs> I think just... that's past its time. They may have said that in the past, though. Oh, that would, well, not for the one. What's the one who does the Cooney? What's his name? Oh, I don't know that yeah, guy. Yeah, that from, one. I wonder. Um, if South Carolina. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> the Caucasian man. Yes. You just have to put that out there. Yes, just <laughs> slide it in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's the coming to the end of our 139th episode of Woke Woke and Free. Free. Guys, this is quite the Woke and Free story time that we call Ranting Truth. If you loved it. 
you know what you can do? You can make sure that you come back again, that you listen to the next episode. So you subscribed to the, the, the channel forever you're listening to this. You've also subscribed via email because what's cool about that is you'll just get an email notification of the new episode. So you'll never miss out and you'll be like, oh my gosh, right? You'll never have to wonder about when the next time you're going to hear beep, beep, beep. Baby, baby. <laughs> yep. Waiting for those sound bites. Priorities, guys. Priorities. And of course, uh, will we leave you hanging for what our next episode will be about? Drum roll, please. On our next episode, we will be discussing what is your hidden superpower. Make sure you follow us on social media to follow along in the conversation. And make sure you tune in next week for Woken Free Wednesday to join the conversation at WokenFree.com. If you'd like to be a guest on the show, please submit a topic for an upcoming episode or to share how you feel on our, wait for it, contact us page at WokenFree.com. So where is that? That is W-O-K-E-N-F-R-E-E.com. When it comes to social media, you can always feel free to hit us up and start a conversation on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and Pinterest at Woken Free. And then again, I say it F like practically every week, guys. COVID-19 is real. Advertising online is real. Where are you at with your podcast advertising? If you want a curated design, one of a kind Woken Free ad for your business, for your book, for your new service, hit us up. Contact us page at WokenFree.com. If you didn't already subscribe, please do share the episode and make sure you come back to join the conversation every Wednesday for Woken Free Wednesdays. Remember, Woken Free is more than a podcast. It is a woke life. Until next time.